uh, we had to call because the, the 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 address that we put because when we click on Google Map it leads us somewhere else. It was a hotel in town. So when we called the person in charge, he finally came and meet with us at a gas station and then we come here. I'm gonna show you the yard. This is uh, the yard here. Hi guys, it's me again, Pierre from My Search for Freedom in Rwanda. Uh, we are going to Musanze, so we are on the road. So for those of you who like to drive on uh, cruise control, like me, when I'm in Canada, if I'm on the highway straight, I put the speed limit on 110, 120, and then on until I get to where I'm going. Unless there is a traffic, I, I slow down, I put the brake, but here I can't really uh, drive uh, on cruise control. It's impossible because the road is so curvy uh, and it's not easy to do that. I haven't even tried. Guys, I can tell you, this is the kind of life that I like, really. The first time I came to Africa to work for that uh, 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 international organization, after our contract, I thought we were going to, I, actually, just before we our contract ended, I thought that I was going to stay in Africa to do my own business, to open my own business, but we didn't do it at that time. But right now, in my search for freedom, that's what I want to do. For me, when I come to Africa, I feel that I am in paradise. good people we have 45 minutes to go so it's been like uh, more than almost two hours we have stopped at night uh, anyway we are still on the road 45 minutes 45 minutes to go village here We are now in Mozambique. 
we will see if it has changed uh, since the time we left we left here in february 2012 we left here in february 2012 and then after that we went to kenya and then in uh, i think in march we went to work in niger so since then we haven't been here uh, we've been to Africa after that but uh, not in Rwanda we have seen a lot of changes we can see actually I can see some changes uh, here uh, entering the city this is the kind of the city center this is the second city of uh, of uh, Rwanda uh, second city Wengeri. The name of the city is Wengeri. So we will show you around uh, after that. Uh, we are going to see if we can find our Airbnb, the place where we we're gonna stay for two days in Wengeri. We'll stay for two days in Wengeri. After that, we will continue. Uh, all the way to the border of Congo DRC and we'll stay in Rubavu in another place called Rubavu we'll stay in a city called Giseni and uh, we'll show you around as well stay tuned be patient we'll show you a lot of things remember to subscribe to like to share and to comment So guys, now we have arrived, but uh, it took us uh, some time to get the address. We had to to call uh, the person in charge here to come and get us from town to be able to find the address. It was a little bit difficult because we turned around at some point uh, when we put the address that was on the website because we are renting a, a Airbnb here. So when we when we put the address when we finally find internet because we had internet on the way to come here but when we get to town we couldn't uh, the connection was uh, not there anymore i don't know what happened but when we arrived uh, we had to call because the, the 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 address that we put because when we click on google map it leads us somewhere else it was a hotel in town so when we called the person in charge he finally came and meet with us at a gas station and then we come here i'm going to show you the yard this is uh, the yard here there's an avocado an avocado tree it's a nice uh, small yard it's not a big it's not a big yard here uh, uh, so this is the yard I will probably turn the camera uh, for you to see this is the yard that's the gate okay this is some uh, portraits on the wall yeah this is uh, the the car that we were driving today uh, here there's an avocado tree here small yard uh, we'll show you around after this is uh, the inside i'm going to show you quickly here this is where this is the common area it's uh, 
there's a, also a little library here. Uh, I don't want to show you. Is it okay to show you? No okay. This is uh, the person in charge. Your name is? Elvis. Elvis. Uh, Elvis is the one in charge here. If we need anything, he will be the one helping us. So this is the living uh, area, the living room, and then the library here. And then I'll show you the, the kitchen. Yeah, this is the kitchen here. We have a stove. Yeah, this is the counter. Uh, there's no fridge though, but everything else, we have everything else, toaster, coffee maker. I think I've seen other stuff in, in that cupboard here. So this is it. And the bedroom where we stay is also this here is another place where if we want to eat here, we can eat there. Um, also the bedroom is here. It's kind of a little bit small, but it's it's fine because we're going to spend only two days here. So it's it's nice and clean. And then this is here. This is a bathroom here. Yeah. So they have hot water. They have what hot water here. It's it's pretty clean. It's pretty nice. Yeah. It's pretty nice. Yeah. So yeah. This is a bedroom here. Uh, the bathroom is uh, just across the hallway. Yeah. So we'll we'll touch base uh, later, and then uh, you'll see more about uh, Muzense. Uh, we'll probably go to a restaurant to eat uh, supper, and then and uh, we'll get back to you after. Take care.